Here we are, Barry. Fancy us being back at the circus after all this time. Fancy. I must say, it was nice of Dan to put our name forward for the job. Shows he thinks a lot of us. He does. Well, remember what Mrs Dan said. He even thinks about us in his sleep. Only the other night he woke up speaking our names. I thought she said screaming our names. Well, whatever. Shows he's thinking about us. Come on, let's get in there. Do you know, I can smell the grease paints and sawdust from here. That's my new aftershave. Is it? It's called Big Top. After the circus? No, the bottle's got a big top. Oh, I'll have to get some of that. What are you doing here? Dan sent us. Why, what have I done? Well, he said you were short-staffed and you needed help. And he sent you? What do you know about circuses? <laughs> what do we know about circuses? Tell him, Barry. Well, what do we know about circuses? Tell him about Coco Chuckle. Coco? Oh, I remember him. But what he got to do with you? He's our uncle. He taught us everything we know. Did he now? And what happened to him? He changed his name to Drinking Chocolate and retired. So, you see, circus is in our blood. Well, if Dan the Van sent you, I suppose I'm stuck with you. But I'm warning you, the circus might be in your blood, but your blood will be in the circus if you mess things up. Now, find something to do. I'm going to have a lie down. Well, what do you want us to do? I don't know. Sort out the props or paint the ring. Anything. Just keep out of my way for a while. Oh, and another thing. What? No slacking. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, oh, dear. He didn't seem very pleased to see us. He didn't. We'll just have to show him how good we are, that's all. How are we going to do that? By starting with the most important thing, the kettle. You go and put it on, I'll make a start out here. I'll be back. Now, where's he? Ah, there's a the kettle. Where's the mugs? They're in here. What's this? I wonder what that's for. Now, where's the mugs? Tea up. Oh, just what the doctor ordered. It's hot. Oh, ah, oh, ah, oh, oh, it is, isn't it? How are you getting on in there? Oh, quick. Hey, Barry, my hand's stuck. Give me a hand. Give it a pull. Pull it. Hey. Pull it. Pull it. On three. One, two, three. Oh, 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 oh sorry. Sorry. Sit down, sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. This is no good. Well, you told us to paint the ring and get the props out, but the props were already out. Not these props. They're for the proper circus. I meant the ones out back. Out back? That's in Australia. I'm beginning to wish I was there with them. Come on, follow me. Hey, I'm stuck. Give me a hand. <laughs> hey, I meant help me up. Oh, oh come on, come on. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> If you hardly notice it, nobody paints my bottom and gets away with it. And get rid of these props. He's not impressed. Maybe we should have used an undercoat. Maybe. Hey, let's get rid of these props. That'll cheer him up. Yes. Come on, let's sort them out. Ooh. We're not here to mess about, Larry. Hey, I found a seesaw. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. It's a bit tiring, though. I tell you what, we'll play on that later. Hey, there's a climbing frame here. Oh. Hey! You're not a 
supposed to be up there. It's dangerous. Come on down immediately. Come down, Danny. But what? I said don't move a muscle. What about a periwinkle? <sighs> yes, Dan, I know, but... Well, I know, but why me? It's not fair. Oh, all right, then. <sighs> right, you men. I've spoken to Dan the Van, and let me tell you, he's not a very happy man. However, he's agreed to let me give you a second chance. As long as there are no more mistakes. Understood? Understood. Good. However, in spite of everything, we've got to put a show on here tonight. And that means working together as a team. Great. Can I play in goal? I'll be centre forward. Not that sort of team, stupid. Not that sort of team, stupid. The sort of team where I tell you what to do and you do it. Right? Right. Good. Now follow me. We've got to get set up for the show tonight. Couldn't we use the things that are already there? No, they're much too big. Flea Circus? Of course. The greatest small show on earth. What did you think it was? Think? We never think. I thought so. Follow me. I thought it was funny when we didn't see any animals. You two go and fetch that table. I'll check on the performers. Where are they? Do you know, I've always had an itch to work in a circus. They're all asleep in this trunk. Oh, no! It's open! They must be strong fleas if they could open that. They didn't open it. Somebody else did. Well, don't do a thing like that. I'll just go and sort that table out. I'll be back in a minute. OK. Oi! Yes? Did you open this trunk? I cannot tell a lie. No. Barry? OK, it was me, but I was only looking for the tea things. That says flea circus, not tea circus. You really are the most incompetent person I've met. Am I? It's nice to know I'm good at something. Can't we just get some more? You don't just get fleas. Our dog did. You don't understand, do you? These are specially trained fleas. We just wouldn't have time to train them before the show. So what we need is something that looks like a flea. Something that's small with skinny little legs. It still wouldn't work. I've told you, I wouldn't have time to train it. Ah, but what if it was already trained? Where are we going to find anything that's already trained? Something small with skinny little legs. Get out of it. I'm not doing that. Get back here. You lost the others. Come on, Barry, aren't you ready yet? Come in. I'm not happy. <laughs> there. What do you think? It's not very flea-like, is it? It looks more like a blue bottle. Well, it's all they had in stock. Do you think we'll get away with it? Oh, I don't know. Ask him to act like a flea. You heard him, Barry. I did. But what's a flea act like? It hops about. Or like this. That's no good. You look like a water beetle with an ingrowing toenail. He does, doesn't he? We'll have to think of something else. Hang on! I can't reach this zip! I've got it! Well, don't give it to me. I've had quite enough for one day. I'm going to have to cancel the show. Oh, you can't do that. Remember what you said? The show must go on. Did I? When? Well, somebody did. Can you do anything else? Collect butterflies? Nah. Anything else? How about singing? No, that'd never work. I haven't got a bad voice, but I haven't sung for years. Just don't worry about that. Come on. What about this zip? I'm not sure about all this. Relax. It'll be fine, won't it, Barry? I don't know. I haven't seen the weather forecast. I mean, the song and dance. I mean, it's not much to offer an audience, is it? Even if I've got a great voice. You'll be fine after a rehearsal. Now, I've got two songs. I've got Singing in the Rain by Gene Kelly or Putting on Your Top Hat by Fred Astaire. Which one do you want? 
Well, he's already got his top hat on. Well, he can soon take it off. Well, seeing as I've got the hat, top hat it is. Right. Go and put it on, Barry. Uh, I used to be a disc jockey, you know. Did you? Yeah, I didn't win any races, though. Yeah. I'm still not happy about this. You see, I'm used to performing with a proper backing. We're right behind you. And I'm not happy with the acoustics, either. In that case, we won't let him in. These Russian acrobats are nothing but trouble anyway. I mean sound. We'll play it through the circus loudspeakers. Of course. See to it, Barry. Right. Now, let's learn the words. I must warn you, though, my voice isn't what it used to be. What did it used to be? As far away from you as possible. But what about the show? What about it? Well, you can't let one small technical little hitch put you off performing. One small technical little hitch? The whole thing's full of technical hitches. And I'm looking at two of them. I'm off. Think of your audience. Yes, you can't deny the audience the chance of seeing you sing. I suppose not. But what can I do? I mean, Top Hat's definitely out. Oh, well, we've still got singing in the rain. We have? Mm. I'll do it. As long as there's no more shenanigans. I want you to do everything I say when I say it. Understood? Understood. Understood. Right. Let's get organised. <laughs> mm. Ladies and gentlemen, unfortunately, my famous fleas have fled, so we'll have to change the programme about. And by way of a change, in front of this wonderful audience, I'm going to give you my version of a song made famous by the great Gene Kelly in Singing in the Rain. Music, maestro, please! Singing in the rain, just singing in the rain. What a... Just a minute, stop the music, stop the music! Hey, come here! What? Well, what's up? What's up? Where's the rain? What rain? Singing in the rain. You're just singing the song, there's no... Well, you've seen Gene Kelly in the film, haven't you? Yes. There's lots of rain. You've got to have lots of rain. Ah, yeah, but he's outside in the street, isn't he, Barry? Of course he was. I don't care. If I don't get rain, I'm not going to do this song. I want rain. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Now what are we going to do? I've got an idea. Come on, over here. Come on, come on. What? Get that, Barry. OK. Right. To me. To you. To me, then, Paul. To you, then. To me. To you. To me. To you, then. To me, then. To you. Right, put it down there. That's right. it. Put it down there. Steady, steady, steady. To me. To you. To me. To you. Steady, steady. To me. That's it. There we are. To me. To me. To me, then. Right. Now what? Well, you go to the top, and when he starts singing, you pour the rain on him. Great. Right, up you go. Right. Go on. Right up at the top. Go on. Go on, Barry. I'm ready. Barry. What? You forgot the watering can. Silly me. Silly you. Come on, get down here. Get it. Go on. Right. Take it to the top. Here I go. Off you go. Off you go. There. Are you ready? I'm ready. Mr. Ringmaster. <laughs> hey, look. We've got it all ready for you. You sure? It's all ready for you. You sure i got plenty of rain? You stand there, sing your song, and you'll get the rain. Music, my show, please. I'm singing in the rain. Hang on, buddy. Hang on, buddy. Go. Come on, get down. Come on, down. Okay. What a glorious feeling. I'm happy again. Get up there. Come I'm on, get laughing at right. So dark up above. 
Hang on. The sun's in the heart. Come on, get down, get down. Quick, quick. And I'm ready for love. Come on, quick, 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 quick. Let the storm be close. To me, to me, to me, to me, to me, to me, to me. Come on, get up. From the place. Come on with the rain. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Have a come smile. Come on. Come on. Where's the rain? Come down, come Just down. a minute. Come Stop on. the music. Stop the music. What's the matter? Where's the rain? Well, you keep dancing up and down and moving away. It's a song and dance, isn't it? Yes. Well, you see, we've got this big ladder and what? We'll... Hey, that's the trouble. Get that thing out of the way. Oh dear, oh dear. Don't you understand? I've got to have lots of rain. You saw Gene Kelly, didn't you? I did, yeah. Dance along the street and the drain pipes and all the water coming down, you see. All the rain, he got drenched. Of course it did. So now you know what I want, don't you? What? Water. Oh. Oh, he wants water, Barry. Right. Yes. Lots and lots of water. Loads of water. You'll get it. Come on, Barry. Right. OK. Music, my soul, please. Oh. I'm singing in the rain. Just singing in the rain. What a glorious feeling, I'm happy again, I'm laughing at times, so dark up above, the sun's in my heart, and I'm ready for love, let the stormy clouds chase everyone from the place. Come on with the rain, have a smile on my face. I walk down the way with a happy refrain Cause I'm singing and dancing in the rain Hey, hey, no, no, steady, steady No, no, that... Stop the music, stop, stop, stop It went very well, didn't it? It did, didn't it? I wonder what happened to those fleas. Hmm.